Hello students, how are you? I hope you all are fine. Today we are going to read the next chapter from your book snapshot Albert Einstein at School by Patrick Pringle. I hope you all know about Albert Einstein who was a physicist. Albert Einstein was born on 1879 and is considered as the greatest theory physicist. His main contribution to physics was the theory of relativity. This led to a massive revolution in physics and due to this, he is considered as the father of modern physics. Albert Einstein was born on 14th March 1879 in Ulm at Germany. His father's name was Hermann Einstein and mother's name Pauline Einstein. He had a sister, Maja, who was two years younger than him. His father and uncle run a company which made electrical equipments in the city of Munich, Germany. In this chapter, it is an extract from the young Einstein the well-known biographer Patrick Pringle describes the circumstances which led to Albert Einstein's expulsion from a German school. So, first we will discuss the main characters of this chapter. The first one is Albert Einstein. Second, Mr. Braun, his history teacher, Yuri, his friend, Dr. Ernest Well, a neurospecialist, Mr. Koch, a mathematics teacher, Elsa, Einstein's cousin sister. So in this chapter, this it's about Albert's class was on the history teacher. Mr. Braun asked Albert when the Persians defeated the French at Waterloo. Albert told him that he didn't know. The teacher said that he had often told him about that. Albert said that he must have forgotten. This irritated the teacher. He asked Albert why. Albert replied that he did not see a point in learning dates. One could learn about them from books. Because ideas are more important than facts and figures. The teacher thought that Albert did not believe in education. He talked in sarcastic manner. Albert told him that learning facts was not education. The teacher said that Albert was a disgrace to be there. Albert felt miserable when he left the school that afternoon. He did not like the school. He would have to come to it again. He lived in a small room. It was one of the poorest quarters of Munich. The landlady beat her children regularly. Her husband came every Saturday. He drank in the evening. He then beat her. He did not like the children's crying every time. He told these things to Yuri. He hated the atmosphere of slum violence. Next time his cousin Elsa came to Munich, she told Albert that if he tried, he could pass the examination. There were more stupid boys than him. Moreover, passing the examination was not difficult. He had not to understand what he is taught. He should merely repeat in the examination. He told Elsa that he was not good at learning things by heart. He liked music as it gave him comfort. He also liked geology. Albert did not like to remain in that school. He met Yuri. After six months, he had an idea. He told Yuri that he needed a medical certificate. It should state that he suffered from a nervous breakdown. Then he could get rid of school. He asked Yuri if he had a doctor friend. Yuri told him that he knew Dr. Ernest Will. Yuri told him not to deceive him. He must be frank with him. Albert visited Dr. Ernest Will. 
then he had really come near a nervous breakdown. Dr. Ernest issued him the certificate. Albert told Dr. Ernest about his future plans. He would go to Milan. He hoped to get admission into an Italian college or institute. It was possible from the comments of the mathematics teacher, Mr. Coach. The mathematics teacher was a different man. He understood, he understood Elbit well. He gave a glowing testimonial to him. He wrote that Elbert knew so much that he could not teach him any more. He was ready to enter a college. The head teacher summoned Elbert, summoned Albert to his room. He wanted Elbert to leave the school then. Elbert asked why it was so. He asked if he should think he was to be expelled the head teacher told him that if he went of his own accord that question did not raise the head teacher gave several reasons for his asking him to leave the school albert's presence made it impossible for the teacher to teach and pupils to learn he rebelled and no serious work would be done while he was there albert felt that the medical certificate was useless now Albert wished to tell him what he thought of him and the school, but he did not. He went out of the room. Before leaving the town, Albert saw Yuri. He had no other real friends there. So, you have now, uh, students, you know about Albert Einstein. That how he made a plan to have a nervous breakdown to be expelled from the school but he was already been expelled from uh, the school by his headmaster because all the teachers had complained about him that he used to irritate the teachers in the class and there will be no atmosphere of teaching while he used to Albert Einstein used to sit there so that's why before he should leave the school. The headmaster had already made a plan to expel Albert Einstein from the school. This is Albert Einstein's home in Berlin. Thank you. I hope you have understood 